Hey guys, I'm going to be telling you about sea cucumbers. Sea cucumbers are echinoderms, the same group that contains sea stars and sea urchins. And no, they are not part of the plant family. They are sausage-shaped animals that lie on their sides and live on the ocean floor in deep and shallow water. There is about 1,200 living species that can range in size from 1 inch to 6 feet. Their bodies are split into a five-part radial symmetry that is apparent from the ring of tentacles around their mouth. Most species have 20 tentacles or another number that is almost always divisible by five. And most sea cucumbers are soft-bodied except a few calcareous plates in their skeleton. They can creep along the bottom by the use of their two feet. They feed by sweeping their mouth back and forth across the bottom. They are nature's vacuum cleaner. They can swallow the sediment on the bottom and filter out the organic material, like algae and animal waste, while excreting the rest. Other species can gather the organic matter suspended in the water with their tentacles. The anus of a sea cucumber not only excretes waste, but acts a lot like gills and is used in breathing. It can take in and expel water. Then, inside the sea cucumber, organs called respiratory trees act to excrete the oxygen from the water. Sea cucumbers have no eyes, but they are sensitive to light. Most species crawl along the bottom slowly, while some can even swim. Their slow mechanisms of movement can leave them vulnerable to predators, so they have developed some interesting defenses. Some have an internal mass of sticky white threads called cuvirarian tubules, and they can be toxic. When threatened, these tubules are extruded from the anus, and they stick like superglue to anything but the cucumber itself. These threads can easily entangle a crab, fish, or other predator. Some sea cucumbers can excrete a toxin called holothurin that is lethal to many predators, including humans. Their last push for survival is ejection of their own internal organs called eviscerate through their anus. This can create a distraction while the sea cucumber makes its escape. However, these organs take months to grow back, and the sea cucumber cannot feed during this time. When sea cucumbers reproduce, the male and females release sperm and eggs into the water. The fertilized eggs hatch into larvae, and then the adult species can live up to 10 years. Sea cucumbers are considered delicacies and are eaten around the world. Their body walls are sometimes boiled and dried to be eaten, or they can just be eaten raw. They're not very good aquarium pets, since their defense mechanisms can poison and strangle other life in the aquarium. These interesting creatures have been around for quite a while. Evidence of their existence goes back 400 million years. If you want to see more videos about unique marine organisms, go ahead and click the subscribe button below.